Say amen. amen. Let us begin with the rules of engagement. Rules of engagement. Engaging. Engagement. Okay. We begin with engagement. Getting it right. The first time. Now let me begin by saying you are not supposed to stay at the engage with the man and learning up. Eh? For three years. Two years. It simply means you are wasting a lot of your time. Some of you, you know, I've been in this relationship. Pastor, I've been in this, this relationship for four years. And it's not working. Leave it. Go home, get another one. Leave it. Go home, get another one. It is not working. No. One year is enough. One. One year and the man should have proposed to you and you should be ready for marriage. I'm giving you charms that will help a man to make a move. Amen. Whether they want it or not. Hallelujah. Yes. And those ladies that are here that are broken to a point whereby they think they do not need this, I also release deliverance as I preach. No. Isaiah 34 verse 16. The Bible says I look at the scroll and I read that none of this especially those who are in Reina's church, none will lack her mate. Praise the name of the Lord. None! None! Including those who have been at broken. I release deliverance in the name of Jesus Christ. And the Bible says, for it is the mouth. It is his. Now, his means the Lord. It is his mouth. That has given a request. Is this saying a request? Is it a request? Is it a request? It is not a request. It is an order. And the spirits. We will gather them together. That means even if your man is in Ukraine, he will be gathered to where you are. I command it to happen in Jesus' name. I don't know. You know I was to teach you about leadership until yesterday. I wanted to teach you leadership and how to choose good leaders because the elections are here. And then Mokami at one particular time told me, have you listened to God or God will follow you? I told, I told, I told Amibes that, you know, God can follow me. This time I want him to follow me with teach leadership. Until yesterday night, things changed. I was told to teach about relationships. And that is what I am teaching. So that is where I have come. I, until yesterday, I didn't know where to begin I slept asking myself now, where do I begin? And I even don't know how to approach this, this particular subject. So I scribbled the things on my phone, a few things. Then all of a sudden, as we are coming this morning, I had promised myself because I I was remembering things at night and I would write, I would write these principles that I am about to teach you. I would write. I will come and compile them well early in the morning. So we woke up early in the morning. As we were coming, our, our vehicle, I don't know what has happened. Mukuyo, take a chop, muk. We were coming. But two is like God servants Migu angels walikuwa hapo wakatushikiria nothing can happen none of their bones can be broken are you jealous 
Are you jealous to a point you are not clapping? Don't be jealous. <laughs> Amen. I will tell you where to apply jealousy. Amen. Jealousy is a virtue. It is not a vice. I will tell you where to apply it. Amen. God says, I am a jealous God. I am like God, jealous God. And men are like God. I will tell you where to apply jealousy so that it can work for you. Amen. Point number one. And you to answer your service in Guinea. Time invasion. Point number one feasibility brings favor and attraction. Rule number one. Rule number one be visible. Visibility brings favor and attraction. Visibility. Be visible. Be visible. Never hide yourself. Appear. Tell your neighbor, appear. You cannot marry in your bedroom. If all you do is to move from church to your bedroom and to your house, a single room, and you do not interact anywhere, you will never marry. And these rules apply both to the righteous and to the unrighteous. Some of you after church, after service, home straight. And you expect to marry next year. It cannot happen. Visibility brings favor and attraction. Matthew chapter number 5, beginning from verse 14 to 16. The Bible says, you are the light of the world. You are a city set on a hill that cannot be hidden. So number one, never hide yourself. Never hide yourself. Some of you, even when people are praying, you sit down. No, people will not see your shape. Stand up, begin moving. Move. Until they see this girl is good. Don't just sit there. You are a city set on a hill. That cannot be hidden. Miss Jambak slide. Um, <laughs> verse number 15. Neither do people light a lamp and put it under a bow. Instead, they put it on a stand so that it can give light to everybody in the house. In short, position yourself where you can be seen by everybody. Position yourself. Some of you, you should be ashes now. Ashes. You move everywhere. Come and sit here. And you will train yourself how to cut walk. You train yourself. But look at you, you are seated there. Nobody is seeing you. Some of you require to be in praise and worship so that people can hear your voice. They can see your black beauty. They can see the way you have applied the cute. Ray, lift up your hands so that they can see your fingers. They are well kept. Lift them up high. Make them visible. It is not demonic. I'm removing that thing, that foolishness. It is called spiritual foolishness from you. In the same way, let your light shine before men. 
that they may see your good deeds be good watu wakisaviwa huku be the first person to serve do good good deeds it is called the art of visibility Esther had to pass before the king Esther village girl had to pass before the king and had to smell nice she was put under perfume six months so that that village kienyenji uo kienyenji wishe akue at least mbroira yani you have to make sure hiyo kitu imeisha and to be put there esta esta amen rule number one, become visible tell you need to be visible yes zikupitange tu hivi hakuna mtu anakuona command attraction somewhere command people to look at you kwanza unapitia pale peko na watu wengi yes wewe kazi yako ni kupitia hivi ukienda town unatokelezea njato mina huko nyuma no pitia mahali hata kuna makanga upitie hivyo stage pitie vizuri that you can be seen we imagine nobody sees you nobody thinks about you and you still want at the things to happen things don't happen they are supposed to happen tell your neighbor things don't just happen they are meant to happen amen tuko na rules kama vada tu so i have taught you one ni sawa sawa ah the other ones tutaanza hapo next uh...